My name is James Williams Jr. This is Come Forever number two. I just deleted a video because it was mistitled and it totally um, went against what I stood for. And it had a Native American woman in there who actually supported Donald Trump. Not on my watch. I don't support Donald Trump because he does not like Native Americans and whatever she was on is is not right. And, you know, if, if you're going to sit here and, you know, support a man who doesn't know what tribe Pocahontas is from and support a man who constantly stares Native Americans in the back and clearly that Native American lady didn't give two shits about the Lakota Sioux Indians and fucking um, Standing Rock, you know, I can't forwardly have you on my channel. I'm not trying to be an asshole to her, because I heard what she said. You know, she doesn't support everything he does, but she supports the fact that he's for the people. He's not for your people. He's not for my people. He's not for the Standing Rock Sioux Tribe. If you want to play that role of supporting this asshole who really doesn't like Native Americans, hasn't liked Native Americans since 1993, which apparently she was not aware of him attacking the reservations in Connecticut and other Native Americans because they don't look Native American. I refuse to um, acknowledge that video. So I deleted it. I'm not going to lie about it. I don't remember the name of it. You guys can find it. She's a very pretty little Native American woman. And um, I decided not to execute my right to um, play that video on my damn channel. And you know... I will say, if I have offended you by not showing you the video that I recorded it, then you need to go to a pro-Trump channel. Because I don't support Donald Trump. I'm never going to support him by choice. You know, there's an old saying, it's better to move on by um, course than by force. And the only reason why I have any support of that bastard is generally by course and not by force. Now, the thing is, you know, we all have our personal opinions about the red-headed demon seed in charge. And that's cool and dandy and all. And if you support them, I'm not judging you. I might question your morals or whatever. But I'm no different. I'm not a saint for not supporting him. But I'm not going to be his fucking hero or his advocate for somebody who... As soon as Obama protected Standing Rock, he, the first damn thing he did was go in and undone the things that Obama did. And while we're on that, he was also one of the front runners of Obama's not really an American. Obama's not really an American. And you hear things like this. And you know, what happens when your people are at bat? What do you do when your people are at bat? Are you going to be as forgiving or you're going to find a solution? You're going to just roll over and die and let them take over and support the things that most people probably shouldn't support? Are you going to do that? Are you going to be willing to be somebody else's lapdog? You know, because, I mean, if you watched any of my videos before this, then you know where I stand, per se, as compared to where everyone else stands. And, you know, it's kind of, um, it's kind of a foul-ass situation, damn it, I hit the wrong button. It's kind of a foul situation when you look at it and you think about the things that, um, people say or people do and then you want to know, well... I stopped the video when the Native American got um, really more on Donald Trump's side than against him. And I sit there and said to myself, the person who put this title up completely did this for people like me who don't support Donald Trump to make us watch it so that they can give you a different perspective of a Native American who's supporting Donald Trump's ideology. <laughs> got some drool there. Well, here's the thing on that. Does his ideology save Standing Rock from having people cut through the land of sacred stuff and oil drilling and all that? No, it does not. And if Donald doesn't want to save Standing Rock, why should I support him? I'm not even a Sioux, but I am part Cherokee. 
and Native Americans have been screwed over time and time and time again and are getting screwed over again and again and again. And then everybody's like, well, he's our president. He's never had to suffer. But that Pocahontas thing, one too far. One too far. I'm James Confused. Come back with number two. I'll make more videos later. Thank you.